Hey guys, I'm Bob. Welcome to the Excel Man channel. And today, this is one of the uh, most important uh, concepts that you need to know. And a lot of people actually ask this question: How do we actually join words? Uh, they are in separate cells to form, okay, a whole string of words, okay, in a cell. So that's why we call concatenate, okay, concatenate using n. So let's take a look. So how do we go about concatenate um, the words itself or the names, all right, using n? So I have a small data set is down here and I have the first name, the middle name and the last name and what I want to do is I want to come up with a full name uh, that includes the space within the sub, the name itself. So for example, first name Dominic space Sarah space Gordon. So how do I go about doing it? It's very simple. Um, what I do is I press equal and then press this first cell which is D9. After that press N all right, to actually combine. Of course, the next thing I have to do is to put a possibly space. This is to include a space uh, in between two words. Then after that, I press and, and then I press Sarah, which is E cell E9. And then I have to do and also, and of course, a possibly space to make sure that there is space in between the names. Then after that, okay, I press Gordon. So after that, I'll be able to come up with the full name that combines the three names. All right, the first name, the middle name, and the last name with space in between. Of course, you can use the concatenate function, right? You can use the concatenate function by doing this, Dominic. Okay, of course, you have to make sure that there's space. Okay, you have to do a possibly space and do a comma and then press E9. Then you have to do a possibly space. Then after that, you press F9 and then, okay, only then, okay, you can come out. So if you to compare the two uh, formulas, uh, I would actually prefer the first one because it is much shorter as compared to the second one. You have to write down the whole word called concatenate. All right. <laughs> All right. This is a very small little trick for you guys. I think I hope that helps. And that's about it for today's video. If you guys have any questions, you can actually comment in the comment section below. And do subscribe for more Excel tips and box. Thank you guys for watching. Goodbye.